What's going on guys? I'm back with another video. Today, I had a massive upgrade to my comic book collection. Let me show you guys what I got. All right, so as you can see, I got a shit ton of comics in front of me. Maybe not a shit ton, but yeah, a good amount here. And I've said it on my channel before, but my dad, heavy into comics, and he was collecting Fantastic Four at one point, but then he stopped. And since I'm starting a Fantastic Four collection, he said I can have all his Fantastic Four books. So now I have them. And I'm going to show you guys exactly what I have now because there's there's a lot. But there is nothing nothing too crazy in here. I mean, can't even lift this up. There's nothing too crazy in here. But yeah, I don't even have any room on the desk for this stuff. So yeah, uh, hold on. All right. Got the other ones moved aside, so I'm just gonna start showing you guys. I'm not gonna go into each one directly, but just to show you guys what I have here. Now, this is one of the newer ones. This is from, I think, slot. This is the the slots run. I think that's what it would be called. But yeah, we got one of those there. Definitely beautiful artwork for sure. And then this is from a different writer and artist. I think Wade. Wade would be the artist there, but we got that there. And then uh, the, okay, so before, yeah, okay. So the rest of them are gonna be earlier on. So we got double-sized annual here. I think this is the only double-sized one that he had. We got a beautiful artwork there with Dr. Doom on the front. This is from just giant-sized annual. So we got that one there. And then we have, I have no idea. Uh, I guess this is Atlantis Attacks, Fantastic Four. So I guess this would be that. But yeah, one there and the rest of them are straight fantastic for the original run. That is it. But yeah, 234 here, starting out with 234, 237. Started reading these. I mean, it does you would think that comic books would be quick to read, but you know, these take up a good amount of time. Beautiful artwork there. <laughs> Got the Doctor Doom right there in the front and center. Got them fighting. All the Fantastic Four members fighting. Doctor Doom. Yeah, you, you would think it would, I mean, I that's what I would think, that it would take not a lot of time to read these, but, you know, they take some time. And slowly but surely, I'm, uh, I'm reading, that's fucking beautiful. That is beautiful there. That is beautiful. But, yeah, just, just reading them. Very, very enjoyable to read as well. But, yeah, we got 2278 there. Let me know if you guys see anything down below like i said none of these are crazy i will say that one of the books i, I want to say aunt petunia had uh her first appearance in one of these books i read it i forget which one it is but we got she hulk there on the front join the fantastic four i i uh, yeah i don't think i have that one yet but she hulk there we got 285 we got 287 289 love to see it i think she ends up quitting in one of these comics coming up i don't know if i have that specific one but she wasn't in the fantastic four for a super a long time she seems to be on every cover now we're up 293 we're getting into the 300s now well, not now but 294 295 i mean you just gotta love the artwork you know what i mean they don't make stuff like this anymore it's all like the first books I showed, I feel like there's a there's an eye appeal to books with this type of artwork. No, oh, that's just me though. Let me know what you guys think think down below. We got two ninety nine. Now we're gonna get into three hundred here. We got the Puppet Master on the front. Love that cover. <laughs> Hopefully he's gonna be in the new movie coming out for Fantastic Four. I think he should be the villain. He might be the villain. I'm not sure, but I'm not really a hundred percent sure what they're gonna do with that movie, but. Got 302 there. Let me know down below if you collect Fantastic Four as well. What your favorite comic book from Fantastic Four is. Mine has to be Fantastic Four 94. Agatha Harkness's first appearance in the comic book world. I actually bought that one. I have it on the way. So stay tuned for that. But we've got 306 here. Coming down to the last book in the stack. We got 307. So that's it for the first stack. Let me get the other stack and I'll show you guys what's in that one. All right, so we got the other stack here. This one's a little bit bigger than the other one, but I'm gonna try and get everything on the screen here. 
should be able to show it. So we got 308 here, 308. So it looks like She-Hulk is out of the Fantastic Four at this point. The Thing is back in because She-Hulk joined the Fantastic Four and then the Thing came, the Thing left the Fantastic, he quit the Fantastic Four in the same comic, I believe. I believe that's how it went. But we got Black Panther on the front who is also another hero in the MCU that made their first appearance in Fantastic Four. I believe it was Fantastic Four 54. He made his first appearance, so I didn't expect there to be that many big characters outside of, you know, the Fantastic Four that would make their first appearance in here. Like, I wouldn't have suspected that Black Panther would be, would be making his first appearance in a Fantastic Four run, but you've got 315 there, got 316. My dad really only had maybe between, he was, he only had in, in the 200s and the 300s nothing nothing super old and nothing super new but that's a cool cover dr doom dr doom there's she hulk marvel versus miss marvel versus she hulk you'd love to see it you'd love to see it we got 322 here the silver Sur silver surfer and 325 we got the the, the frightful four and this one we got 327 here. We got 328. 329. Oh, this one's cool. This one's sick. This one is sick. I'm not going to lie. That is beautiful. 330. That is beautiful. We got 331. 332. So I believe that I'm still trying to learn how how the the ages the ages group works so i want to say this is all bronze age stuff i think i want to say gold age is is super old super super old i, I believe that's before that maybe before the 60s i'm not exactly sure that the specific years i want to say the silver age is 60s i want to say the silver age is the 60s and then everything after so i i think this would all be considered bronze age and then I think there's a there's an age called the Copper Age. I'm not sure, but I hear my dad talk. I'm trying I'm trying to learn here. I'm trying to learn here. We got we got a Thor and Iron Man on the front as well with the Fantastic Four. That's cool. We got 338, 340 here. And then we have 341, 342. What is that? Cameo appearance by the Spider-Man. Nice. This is a cool cover. We got Goat. Dude, what does that say? Nuke Buster. The Nuke Buster. I was about to say Ghostbusters. This is a Nuke, Nuke Busters. Got the Nuke Busters there. We got that. We got 345 here. We got 346. This one's cool. We got the villains in the back. You got Than. Oh, I think that's Thanos. You got Spider-Man, Ghost Rider, Wolverine. You got everybody on there. That's sick. And then we have... I want to say that... Doesn't Wolverine end up joining at some point? I'm not sure. I'm not sure. I, I'm still trying to learn here. <laughs> I'm still trying to learn. We got the thing on the front. Got the Devastator. Devastator coming into play. This one's cool. That is sick. That is sick. We got... 366 is clobbering time. 367. We got 369. We got Galactus on the front there. That is cool. Silver Surfer. Here we go. We got 372. We got 385, the Deadly Deep. There we go. Got Fantastic Four 390, the coming of Galactus. Got another puppet master here. That was Uwatu there. That's Uwatu, the Watcher. I just started watching though. I actually finished season one of What If. Phenomenal show. I didn't think it was going to be that good. I stayed away from it because it was a cartoon, but I'm not holding grudges against that. It was a phenomenal show. I'm on season two right now. Got the puppet master there as well. I don't even know what this is to be honest with you. It's in a. It's in a. Get a piece of the action. Poly it includes a poly bag. I'm not sure, but 394 there. 
Then we got 395, The Thing versus Wolvie. We got Doom Quest here, 369. There we go. Ooh, Watu on the front as well. And last but not least, we have. So this is not part of the original run, so I guess this was in the back. But yeah, we got Delph. Oh, maybe it is. I don't know. I have no idea. I don't even see an issue number on here. I don't even see an issue number. Maybe this is just a one-off. I'm not sure. Uh, yeah, let me know down below. But yeah, that is all the books that I got from my dad. And hopefully we can keep, keep building on top of it. Like I said, I have some more coming in the mail. Stay tuned for those. But yeah, thank you guys for watching. Stay tuned till next video. Bye.